Hey there, Libra. Welcome to your reading for the week of October 5th. Libra, you had a great October reading in general, and, uh, you know, the first week here, kind of technically the first week of the month, really, uh, is is no different. You have the Nine of Clubs coming up first. Great card to have. This is earning something. It's an achievement, something, you know, you've been kind of hoping would happen, and it's a very positive card. It does say that the achievement will be kind of like trickling in. Is, this isn't something you earn all at once. It's like you're working towards it, but you can see that you're working towards something great in your life, and it could be in any area, love, money, finance, business, job, whatever, could be almost anything, but you can see how you're finally starting to work towards something really, really positive, and this just kind of gives you extra growth and power in those areas. It's a great card to have um, because it does say that you are absolutely on the right track, so if you're like looking for a new job or, 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 you, you, know, or you found that new job, you're definitely on the right path. If you're starting a business or something along those lines, you're on the right path. If you start a new relationship, you're definitely on the right path, so just know that. The next card you have is the King of Hearts. Great card. I actually feel like the King of Hearts and the Queen of Hearts came up right next to each other, which is crazy. Um, I feel like love is on the table for a lot of you. And, um, you know, so the King of Hearts can definitely represent somebody coming into your life. They would probably be a water sign male. Uh, and, you know, uh, it could be a relationship coming in. Like I said, they would be very hardworking and very positive people. Hearts cards are very positive people usually. So that's definitely on the table. If you're with somebody, this can just be the energy around you, and it can represent being very positive this week and just having very positive feelings and all of those things. Uh, next, you have the Queen of Hearts. So again, for some of you, this might be a female coming into your life that is attracted to you as well. The good news also about the King of Hearts and the Queen of Hearts is that they are also, it's a reciprocal thing. So if you are single and one of these two comes into your life, it, they also are attracted to you. They're very, um, like I said, reciprocal is the best word that I can think of. They, they will like you kind of on an even same level that you like them so that's a good sign but queen of hearts can also represent just needing to use your intuition this week and to really trust your gut on all situations and to really um you know believe in yourself it can also represent needing to be nurtured so i feel like love is coming to a lot of you and not like a moment to soon really because you know having this many heart cards it can represent wanting a relationship really wanting to be in a relationship and wanting to feel that like love and, and things like that so just know that's on the table for a lot of you. A lot of you um, could be experiencing those sorts of things. And finally, um, Ace of Diamonds coming up. I feel like you might have had this in your in either one of your last weeklies or um, your monthly reading. I can't remember exactly, but this is just more good stuff business and money-wise coming in, getting a large amount of money coming in. A lot of stability around work and finance and, and more stability coming in. The good news is I feel like, again, with that nine of clubs, it's going to last a long time. And it's like, so you're building something very stable so that your life can be very stable and not so like up and down and crazy. It'll just be very stable and supportive and, you know, will make you really happy. So all in all, an excellent way to kick off the month, really. So enjoy it.